Did Gene Simmons give Getty Lee a bass lesson? Let's talk about it. So I recently did a video on Jimmy Page complimenting Gene Simmons as a bass player. And in that video, I had an, a screenshot where Gene Simmons claimed he had given Getty Lee a bass playing lesson. And a lot of people responded to just that image in the comment section, even though I didn't cover the incident in the video. So I thought I'd cover it. And this comes from an article from Ultimate Guitar written by Justin Beckner. And the title of the article is Gene Simmons recalls giving Rush's Getty Lee a bass lesson. He didn't understand what a blues scale was. And the article goes on to talk about musicianship in general, meaning whether or not popular artists by and large are well versed in reading and writing music. And Simmons talks about how the fact that Jimi Hendrix and John Lennon or Paul McCartney are quote, anyone who's popular in music almost without exception, unquote, is unable to read and write music. He goes on to say, quote, and likewise, I can speak various languages, although it's not important to be able to read or write, unquote. So this is the context for the quote about his giving Getty Lee a bass lesson. And in the exact context comes from when he was talking about a story when Kiss took Rush out on Rush's first American tour. Quote, they came out to support us, you know, because we liked what they did. And this was in the time of their working man period when they sounded kind of like Canadian Zeppelin, which I still prefer sound wise, but obviously they've done very well. And we used to hang out with the guys and joke around and everything. One night back at the hotel or backstage someplace, Getty Lee and I were sitting down trading licks and I said, do you want to do a blues scale? You go first and then I'll continue the chord pattern. And he said, I don't know what you mean. At least from what I recall, Getty didn't understand what a blues scale was or what one, four, five meant. That also bears noting that when you go one, four, five to a musician, that means something. It's a relationship of notes or chords. And so I go, well, okay then, you hit a G, either octave or low, and he said, which one is that? Getty played purely by ear. Now, of course, later on, he learned what the notes were and stuff like that. But it's the same thing with the edge. The reason you hear jingle, jangle, jingle, jangle kind of thing that became the style of U2's guitar sound is when the edge started playing guitar in a band, he couldn't play chords, end quote. What he's trying to say there is that instinct and feel and passion and natural native musicality is sometimes much more important in terms of rock music and popular music than having book knowledge of music. It's almost the same kind of argument that's been going on in my series of videos on guitar players, where it's some guitar players play with flawless technique and others play by feel. And no one way is better than the other, but some prefer one way to the other. And what I've been saying in my personal opinion is that it's a blending of the two that's the most important. I think that is what Getty Lee exemplifies as a musician, is a blending of natural native instinct and talent and schooled musicianship. Now, as far as the claim that Gene Simmons gave Getty Lee a bass lesson, well, that's not even really what is being said in this story. What's being said in this story is that Getty Lee didn't understand what was meant by one, four, and five, and he didn't understand what a blues scale is. That doesn't mean that you gave somebody a bass lesson, it just means that you informed them about some terminology they hadn't been aware of before. Now, I don't think that Gene Simmons is even claiming that he gave him a bass lesson, and he wasn't trying to say that he was a better bass player or that Getty Lee needed his help. He was trying to pay him a compliment by saying, hey, the guy doesn't even need to know what the notes are because he's so brilliant. But the thing is, Getty Lee went on to become a schooled musician, and this shows his dedication to craft. So that's what Gene Simmons is trying to say in that comment, but the way that it's been twisted around in social media here recently has been to suggest that Gene Simmons said he taught Getty Lee how to play bass. 
I don't think he was saying that here. I, th I think he was just putting Getty in with all the other musicians he had mentioned that were massive players and massively influential musicians who didn't necessarily read or write music. This is what I think, but what really matters is what you think. So if you have an idea about this or any other topic connected to classic or contemporary music, please drop it in the section below and remember to like and subscribe. Also, hit the join button if you'd like to become a member of the site. As a member, you'll have access to members-only videos, members-only polls, members-only badges, and lots of other cool things you'll see when you click the button. You can also help the channel by clicking on the Buy Me A Coffee link, going to the Buy Me A Coffee site, and leaving a donation. Every little bit helps this channel stay strong. Thanks so much.